I am headed to a fish store one hour south of me to buy some plants for my fish tanks. And yes, I said tanks, plural. I admit it, I am a fish nerd. Um, and obviously my life is so boring and lonely that I'm too interested in YouTube and YouTubers. Uh, but I want to talk about what is going on with the Crockers and Sawyer Ridge Farm. If any of you went to that meetup, uh, I think it's in Pryor, Oklahoma, uh, that was put on by the Crockers YouTube channel and Sawyer Ridge Farm YouTube channel, please share this video with, with anybody you know that went to that meetup or if you went to that meetup, please comment and tell me what went on at that meetup. Uh, here's my question. I I did a video about the Crockers and, and I mean, I in, it says the Crockers, but it's pretty much just Jason Crocker. And now his twin brother, Jared, has his own channel and Matt has his own channel and his parents have their own channel. But the Crockers is really Jason Crocker. And about a, two years ago, um, Jason, when he moved to Oklahoma, he had no water, no electricity. He was living off grid, or at least he claimed to on his videos. And this young couple, Jacob and Alex, I think is her name, Sawyer, befriended him. And oops, I just about lost my I'm <laughs> making a turn. But anyway, Jason was befriended by Jacob and Alex Sawyer. And they have a YouTube channel called Sawyer Ridge Farm. In my opinion, they are the sweetest couple. They are just the sweetest couple. They seem very genuine. They seem like a real sweet church going couple, which I think YouTube needs more of. And they just have a real wholesome channel. And I think they reached out to Jason Crocker when he moved to Oklahoma as a fan of his YouTube uh, channel and, uh, and helped him out and they became friends. And I'm sure a lot of people say, oh, they befriended him and, and to make their channel grow. But I don't think that. I really think that Alex and Jacob are just sweet people and, and they were helping him out. I mean, they, they became such a good friend to him that I think from what they said on their channel and Jason said on his channel, the Crockers, they were letting him come to their home, which was an hour away from where he was doing his off-grid thing, and take showers once a week. I think they were letting him fill up his water containers because he didn't have water where he was. So I think they were truly a uh, friend to him. I know at one point on the channel, uh, Jason drove this old truck. Matter of fact, I think he's still driving that truck in his latest video, I saw it. But he drove an old truck that had over 100,000 miles. And uh, he's from Texas, so he didn't have any family around. The old truck broke down, and Jason and Alex, I believe, let Jason uh, stay with them in their home while his truck was being fixed. So, so I really think Sawyer Ridge Farms, y'all go check them out if you hadn't already, uh, really are good folks. And I think they were really a friend to Jason. But what my question is, what happened to the friendship? Um, you know, there for a while, I mean, I'd say for a year, the Sawyer Ridge Farm and the Crockers, both both YouTube channels, were collaborating often. I mean, there were so many live chats. Sawyer Ridge Farm would have a live chat where Jason would be there, and it was great. It was some of the best live chats I've seen on YouTube. Was when Alex and Jacob and Jason were all together, just sitting sitting around in, in the Sawyer's house and having a live chat. It was so funny. They they truly seemed to like each other, and they would joke with each other and kid with each other. And I miss those. I miss those live chats. Um, you know, Jason goes live, but they're just not as interesting without the Sawyers there. But I miss that. And anyway, why, why I'm on here today is I just want to know, does anybody know what happened? Because they went from seeing each other often, us seeing them as YouTube fans in, each, in their videos together, them talking about one another, them um, promoting one another's YouTube channels to nothing. I mean, you don't hear Jason Crocker mention the Sawyers. You certainly don't see them collaborating anymore. As a matter of fact, in the last month or so, I've seen videos where Jason actually kind of um, threw some shade on some Homestead YouTubers. Now, I don't know which Homestead YouTubers he means, but I wonder if he meant the Sawyers. And I hope not, because, man, they seem like a sweet couple. And, uh, you know, they just seem so nice, and they really helped him out a lot. I sure hope that he is uh, appreciates all that they did for him. If you do, um, if you 
you did go to that meetup, please comment and tell me what happened. I kind of wonder, and this is just me speculating, because I, again, I say I'm so boring and lonely that I have time to think about these, these people. But I'm wondering, did something happen at the meetup that they had at Alex and Jacob's church? Because, you know, two years in a row, they had a meetup. The Crockers pretty much put it on with a few other um, YouTubers that had, you know, similar channels. They did this meetup at Jason, at Jacob and Alex's church. And the first one, I think, was wholesome. Maybe there wasn't a lot of drinking. But I wonder if that next meetup got a little rowdy and maybe something happened that made them, you know, uh, that damaged their friendship. Uh, the other thing that I've actually heard people say on other YouTube channels is that maybe there was a dispute about the um, sawmill. You know, if you remember, Jason Crocker got this sawmill. I don't know. I, I don't know if he bought it or just some sawmill company uh, gave it to him so he could do a review. I, I kind of think it might have been that. I don't know though. But anyway, Jason had this sawmill that. Um, had delivered him and he took it to the Sawyers and the Sawyers had it for quite some time. I wonder if maybe that's what they had a falling out about is about the use of the sawmill. But anyway, if any of you know what happened between Sawyer Ridge Farm and the Crockers, please comment down below and let me know. Okay guys, see you next time. Bye.